Hi everyone, this is Mukesh Chutwani once again from learn-fashion.com. I'm very happy to announce that we are starting our new batch which is web automation using Selenium with Java which is starting from 14th of November 2023. This is the last batch of this year. After this, the next batch will in Feb or March 2024. So if you're looking for a automation course, if you're looking for a job change, if you're looking for a promotion, internal switch, hikes, whether you're looking for remote jobs, this can be the right course for you. This will be a V-Day batch, we'll have live sessions, no recorded videos. It will be completely live every day, Monday to Friday, 7 a.m. to 8 a.m. IST. After every session, we will have a doubt session. And after this doubt session, if you have any other doubts and clarification required, again, we have a doubt session from 9 a.m. to 7 p.m. IST. So even if you have not written any program in the past, even if you are zero in programming, we will teach you everything from the scratch. If you have some programming knowledge in the past, that will be added advantage. But if you are not having any experience, that is also fine because we always start from the scratch. Throughout the course, we not only discuss Selenium, we discuss everything that is required in order to build architect or any senior roles or for any job change. We'll start with Java. Right from what is Java, what is JDK, what is JVM, JRE, till the framework development, we will be discussing Java. After Java, we always start with Selenium, which will help you to automate your web browsers. Once you understand complete Selenium, we also start TestNG, which is unit test framework. The moment you start designing framework, you need one of the unit test framework. For Java, we have JUnit and TestNG. We'll take TestNG and we'll continue with our framework development activity. After that, we always start one of the build tool. So when it comes to Java, we have two build tools. One is Gradle, one is Maven. We'll pick Maven and we'll understand how Maven works, Maven life cycles, different goals we have, which goals we have to use, which plugins to use, how to generate a build, how to generate parameterized build. After this, we start framework development. We will teach you how to build framework from the scratch, right from the skeleton till the complete framework with number of tests, with cross browser and parallel execution. We also use different third party reporting libraries. We use extend report. In case if you want to use any other reporting, we can take that as well. Once you understand how this complete framework part works, we also start Git and GitHub, where we will teach you how to work with different kind of SVN, SCM tools, different cloud repositories that we have, how you can generate your own pipeline on GitHub itself using GitHub Actions. And after this, we start Jenkins, which is one of the CI server to build your test pipeline. After this, we also talk about Selenium Grid, how you can create a Selenium Grid locally, how you can create your Selenium Grid on cloud using Docker. Once you understand everything, okay, we'll have a detailed session on AWS how you can create your first virtual machine, how you can host your Jenkins on AWS, how you can host your complete grid on AWS. It will be completely practical. So whether you're fresher, experienced, all the possible scenarios you can answer in interviews or even if you're looking for internal promotions. These are just few important highlights. If you want the detailed information, I will share the course curriculum with you. You can go through the complete syllabus. If let me know if you need to add any specific topic you want to remove any topic we can discuss and we can do that on the fly apart from this these are the live classes after these classes you will be getting assignments which you have to solve you will be having every week module test so once we complete a specific module you will have a live test you will get the report with the explanation of each and every question Apart from this, we also have breakout sessions where we create multiple groups and every group will be solving a particular problem. Apart from this, we have mock interviews. Once you complete this course, if you're looking for a job change, if you want to attend mock interviews, let us know once you are done with your complete course, we will have mock sessions and we will also provide the feedback. We will help you in the resume process as well. We will give you multiple templates for freshers, for experienced candidate, you can use our template and you can build your own resume. In case if you need any modification in your resume, which you already have, we can propose some changes according to that as well. Now, let me answer a couple of frequently asked questions. First question is, what if I miss certain classes? No problem. You will be getting recordings after every class. So whenever you get time, you can watch the recording. Recording will be uploaded on the portal. 
not only recording everything that we will discuss throughout the class whether it's a uh, java classes pdf any material notes everything will be uploaded in the portal you can log into the portal and you can access everything you will be having course access for the lifetime generally after every two years you will see a major change but we will give you the lifetime access so in case if you are not able to complete due to personal emergencies due to office work you can go through the recordings whenever you get time and let me know if you need any help while going through the recordings so the course price is one two seven double one after gst it will come around fifteen thousand for india outside india it's two fifty dollars so i will be sharing all the details in the description of this video so if you need any other information if you are looking for any specific question reach out to us you can call us you can mail us and we will try our best to support you we also have some additional bonuses so if you are completely new to qa in order to start automation you need to have some idea of manual testing so we will be giving you the recordings of manual testing we will also give you recordings of database we will also give you the recordings of api testing using postman these are the additional recordings you will be getting once you enroll to this course yeah that's all from my side so thank you so much for watching this video in case you are not looking for this course you can share this course with your friends colleagues those who are looking for a change or who are planning to learn automation that's all for this video. Thank you so much and I will see you in the next video. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.